Good evening. Hope you're having a great Thursday. Boy, the view earlier today was absolutely gorgeous over the mountains. Uh, a little bit less humidity brought in slightly more comfortable air and some better visibilities. Well, we're talking about hotter weather, though, into the upcoming 4th of July weekend where temperatures are going to be in the lower 90s for your 4th of July. So we've got some heat on the way. Prepare for uh, the hot weather and staying cool and keeping hydrated. Spotty thunder shower chances a little bit more uh, likely on Sunday as far as our chances, isolate chances beforehand and higher thunder shower chances are expected into early next week. You know what? Today was pretty much very close to average. One degree above on the high. We hit 89 today and one degree above average for the low. We hit 69. There are your records for this date. July 2nd, no rainfall since midnight. Well, let's talk about a frontal boundary that got just south of us and a little bit more of a drier flow uh, moving in from the east northeast. So that brought us a little bit again uh, the better visibility, drier conditions. So instead of having all the heavier showers and storms of flooding, when you get the drier air and the front moving through, most of the scattered thunder showers are tied in closer to that front down in Georgia and the Carolinas. So you can kind of see some lightning popping as of early this evening down there. Here's a look at our future cast heading into our Friday. Mainly dry, slight chance for an ice thunder thundershower of the Southern Valley Mountains, and same forecast for Saturday, July 4th. Mainly dry, slight chance for an ice thunder thundershower toward the mountains and areas just south of us. That's that same old frontal boundary to our south. Now, by Sunday, that front may propagate more a little bit northward, and we could see some spotty thunder showers in the afternoon. Afternoon. But you know what? Tonight's pretty comfortable. You already know how nice it is outside. A warm but otherwise a pleasant early evening and mild overnight, mostly clear, 67 for the low. So we'll take that. A little patchy fog in the morning. A hot afternoon for your Friday, though. Humidity not overly high, but still hot and mostly sunny. So don't forget the sunscreen, wear a hat, stay cool, stay hydrated. There's your 4th of July forecast. Uh, temperatures in the lower 70s at 8 a.m. and lower 90s by 5 p.m. Mainly dry and hot. There's that better chance for at least some spotty thunder showers Sunday. Hot and humid Sunday near 90 degrees. Upper 80s then for early next week, most of next week actually, with a better chance for scattered thunder showers as we head toward our Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Have a great night.